Today we're going to take our very first look at Crown Zenith, the final set of Sword and Shield era. I cannot believe it's coming to an end. It's been a wonderful, wonderful journey through Sword and Shield. But guys, let's take a look at the complete set include all the way up, including the gold cards, which are going to be the big chase cards. Let's get right into it, and uh, don't forget to smash a like. Today we are going to take our very first look at Crown Zenith, the visual set list. Now this is just a prospective set list, um, so this may not be completed yet, uh, but let's take a look at some of the amazing cards that we'd be able to pull. We are going to go through all of the cards that are on the list, so it looks like we've got a little oddish, looks absolutely amazing, so happy in the garden there. We've got a gloom just falling over and, you know, it looks like it maybe got punched in the mouth a little bit because there's spit coming out of the mouth. <laughs> but yeah we've got loads of uh, we've got loads of great uh great commons and uncommons as you can see down in the bottom corner here they have changed the way that they are um being recognized on the card so you've got c's you've got u's you've got uh we get into it later but you've got ars sars you've got ultra rares which are urs um yeah there's a there's a whole new way of uh, the pokemon cards being uh being shown scyther looking amazing sunkern very nice We've got lots of uh, amazing cards in this set. I did scroll through and uh, take a little sneak peek. I didn't go into all of the bigger cards. Um, Leafeon looking absolutely amazing. Uh, it looks like we've gone through all the grass types um, to start off with. But these are just looking amazing. Oh, very nice. He looks bad ass in that picture. Very nice artwork. But yeah, uh, so uh, yeah, Crown Zenith is going to be the final set of uh, the Sword and Shield era, um, and um, it is set to uh, set to come out very very soon. It's Hangula. Um, are we finding duplicates now? All right. Okay. So let's move down. Oh my God, we're into the fire section. Charizards, Charizard V Star. Now I think some of these are. There's the Radiant. That's going to be the Radiant. Um, I think some of these are uh, reprints from other sets. Um, very nice artworks, though. Beautiful. <laughs> Just chilling in the fireplace. I love that. But yeah, tell me what you guys think of some of these artworks down below in the comments section. Like, what's what's going to be your chase card? Um, what's yeah? What's going to be your chase card? What's going to be uh, what's going to be the cards that you're going to go after? Now, once we get to the gold cards, you will absolutely love them. Corefish there, snow runs, love disc. I I don't know why, but I love the love disc. I don't know why. Oh my god, that is amazing! Look at the waves. The waves that just pop off. Very nice. Some amazing artworks. All oh, the Glaceon V. Celio. They are just amazing. Some like the artworks in this set are just absolutely sublime. Um, a little baby Shinx. Oh, look at the little chubby cheeks. The chubby cheeks. That is so beautiful. That's a great card. And badass Rotom. Let's go, Rotom V Star. But yeah, some some of these artworks are just absolutely beautiful. Um, I'm I'm really looking forward to opening up Crown Zenith when it launches. Um. I think it is mid-January. It is due to launch right about the 20th, I do believe. Um, I could be wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong. But these cards are just absolutely sublime. Here we go into the Psychics. Mewtwo. Oh my god, about to throw that. Uh, is that is that like some some form of like pa Plasma Blast or something? It won't be a Plasma Blast, will it? Mew. Very nice, very nice psychics. Oh, that looks very scary. That looks scary. Beautiful, beautiful psychics. Not too many psychics in this uh, in this set. Okay, that's what's up. And then we go into the fighting. We got good old Graveler, Soul Rock, Baltoy. Just howling at the moon. Just see that? Just howl. Love that. Love that. Absolutely amazing. Only, uh, only a small selection of fighting as well. Here we go, dark. Very nice artworks. The the artworks are just getting better and better by the set, aren't they? I mean, 
don't get me wrong, the Silver Tempest I thought was amazing. Amazing for artworks. But Crown Zenith, I mean, oh, the way to finish off an era of Pokemon. These artworks are 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Absolutely rocking it. Oh, baby Aaron. Baron, Agron. Very nice. Is that a clay? Is that... Very nice. Very cool. Haven't seen one of them in a while. The V-Stars just look brilliant, don't they? I mean, like, it's just... They're just next level. They're next level, guys. Honestly, they really are. Absolutely beautiful there. Okay, it looks like we've got some Rayquaza V-Max. That's definitely a reprint. That's definitely a reprint. That's a reprint. Pretty sure. Not too sure about the V-Max. I think that might be as well. Uh, is that the Eternus? That's the Radiant Eternus, I think. So there's some of the... Uh, there's some of the... Uh, big big hitters that people are going to be going for. Not the biggest. Not the biggest of hitters. Oh my god, look at that ditto just stretched out. Like just absolute show it off. Like, it's just like, come at me, bro. Let's have this. Eevee! Hello, Eevee. Oh my god, look at that snore. Like, that's so cute. I kind of want that for, like, a plush. I kind of want that for, like, a plush. That looks pretty cool. Darley. Very cool. That's Stoutland, then. <laughs> I love it. Rafiki. Get that reference. You should do. Very cool. Very cool. Right then, let's go into the trainers. So here we go. Here are the trainers. Oh, these are a little bit smaller. I do apologize. And then, okay, that was just, maybe it was just that one. Just that one card. We got Thor's hammer. We got Mjolnir. <laughs> we got two guys just chilling out, backpacking. Energy grabs. Okay, that's what's up. Very nice. Very nice. I just love the way that the colors just pop off the cards. Like, of recent sets, it, it, it's just, it's amazing. They're just so simply amazing. We've got like some sort of like character draw drawing on here. That's actually pretty cool. I like that little addition to the card there. Um, is that Leon? Is that Leon there? I can't, can't remember if that's Leon. Uh, the vacuum cleaner is back. Let's go. Vacuum cleaner is back. We got the good old Pokeball opening up to show the goods. We got a death ray. <laughs> hey, it's a potion. Does anybody actually use potions? I. Rare candy, I'm guessing that's going to be, maybe. I'd imagine so. It does look like one. Got that stone. Pokeball, Pokeball trader, maybe, or Pokeball swap. Some running shoes. The Ultra Ball. Very nice. Very cool. And then we're back to Thor's hammer. Okay, so that is the trainers uh, from the looks of it. Now, here we go. The full art trainers. Now, I believe that this full art trainer here, um, I can never, can, can never remember her name, but this full art trainer right here is worth an absolute fortune, apparently. Apparently, straight out of the pack, this is like a £120 card. It's insane. I don't know why. I've been watching a few videos, and I've seen people pull these, and every time they pull them, the price comes up, because obviously a lot of people like to show the prices off. It comes up at like $150, which is about £120 pounds, uh, over here in the UK. And I, I, I don't know why. It's a beautiful card, obviously. But, um, yeah, I don't know what set this is from. I can't put... Uh, maybe Fusion Strike? I'm gonna go for Fusion Strike, as it says Fusion just there. Um, but if I am wrong, correct me down in the uh, comments. But, yeah, it's just an absolutely stunning card. Um, we got some fr we got some pals just hanging out. Just big chilling. Even more. Everyone's looking really happy. Is that Cynthia? Hello, Cynthia. Professor. And then we've got a leader. Very nice, very nice. Uh, right then, here we go, here we go. Into the, So this is now called the Galarian Gallery, guys. The Galarian Gallery, these are called. Okay, so this is the Voltorb. Cricket Salt, I'm going to guess that is. There's there's always loads of uh, Pokemon in, in the uh, in the galleries. Um, so we, I'm never, not too sure which uh, it's going to be. So this could be either Magmortar or the Electivire. Um, I'm unsure which one that's going to be for. Um... Oh, wait, it's going to be for the uh, Magmar, sorry, actually, because there's Magmar. We've got a dancing bird. 
looking cool. Lapras. That was one of my favorites from the uh, from the OG set. That is, that's one of my favorites. Very cute. That's very cute. Oh my god, look at that. Look at that. Just mirror images on the lake below. That is beautiful. Uh, there's the Electivire. Hanging out with Magmortar as well. Are they best of pals now? Like, what's going on here? And then we've just got some, uh, we've got some Pokemon just hanging out in the, uh, in the arcade. Like, just having fun. We got Rillaboom in the back just playing the drums. <laughs> That's actually, oh, that is so cute! Mew asleep, being protected and looked at by all of the Pokemon around it. Just hugging, like, what seems to be a berry or, like, some form of pear. Um, that is so cute. Uh, unsure who this is going to be for. Uh, maybe the Lunatone. It could be the Volbeat. Unsure what that card is going to be for. Uh, I'm going to say the Lunatone because for the simple fact that it's the, it's the larger Pokemon. Um, and we do have, obviously, the moon in the background there. Um, very cool. Very cool Deoxys there. That is stunning. Look at all the diamonds there. Uh, is there a Pokemon on there? I can't see a Pokemon. Oh, oh, it's just there. It's just there. I was like, oh my god, that faded in so well. I was like, is this just a picture of flowers? Like, <laughs> Soul Rock just big chilling. Absol, very nice. That Magnazone, very nice, very cool. Oh, Taria. There are some amazing cards. Is this a ditto? Is that di is that ditto? Because these look normal, but that one looks a little bit. Di is this going to be a ditto card or a normal card? I'm gonna say I'm gonna say that's going to be a ditto card. That's that's an amazing rare as well. These are all amazing rares. Um, very cool, very cool. Mill tank just big chilling with all the dairy products. I love it. Love to see it. Oh, he made himself a little home. I love that. Riolu. Swablu. Doof. Oh, there is Pikachu flying in high on the leaf. That is such a beautiful card. Such a beautiful card. Now, I believe you can get a God Pack in the V-Star Universe um, uh, boxes. Um, so if you do go and uh, check them out and you do make videos or you do want to share them in the Discord, please share some of your polls if you do manage to get a God Pack. Um, a lot of these cards are in the V-Star Universe. Um, and uh, this is actually one of the cards you get in the God Pack, apparently. Um, so if you do open up those boxes or packs and you manage to get one, please let us know. Because we'd love to come and check out the content for that. Harris. Harry. Leaf Beyond. That is beautiful. Just hanging out in a greenhouse there. Just absolutely big chilling. Beautiful card. Oh, now that looks amazing. Look at the way, like, the, um... The lava's coming out of the, uh, volcano. Just absolutely, uh... Pop. Makes the card pop. Makes the card pop there. Very nice. Just walking over the frozen lands. Glaceon V, very nice, very cool. Just big chilling, Ryoku. Oh my god, look at that! The sparks just flying off as it's running. Just oh, like the, the warp speed of the uh, the hollow at the back there as well. That is insane. Great card, great looking cards. Um, oh my god, there we go. The Charizard versus Mewtwo. Looks like we got a Tangler being caught up in the battle as well. Get out of there, Tangler! Save yourself. Save yourself. Mewtwo card that is, guys. That is a Mewtwo V-Star. Absolutely amazing. That card is beautiful. That'd be one of the big chase cards there. Um, very nice. It looks like we've got a Deoxys VMAX as well. And then the V-Star. That looks really cool. Can't really see what that card is. Very nice V-Stars. Yeah, so these are all SARs. Look, down here it says SAR, so that is Secret uh, Art Rare. That's what they're called now. Secret Art Rares. As we're moving into the next uh, set, they are changing the way that it is shown on the card of how you uh, find out how uh, what, what kind of card you have. Uh, oh, that is beautiful. That is beautiful. That card is literally a piece of art. Very nice. Um, full Art Trainer. Full Art Trainer. Full Art Trainer. 
Cynthia. Hello, Cynthia. I don't know why. I love Cynthia. She's awesome. She looks so badass. It's great. Cooking breakfast, I love that. Oh, thinking about breakfast, actually. Hello. Big chilling, that Aerodactyl just uh, hanging from the ceiling there. Oh, here we go then, guys. The gold cards. Here we go. Now, I'm pretty sure there's an Arceus V... Uh, I'm pretty sure there's an Arceus V-Star gold card in this, which absolutely is insane. I think it's going to be the big pull card, to be honest with you. Um... But let's take a look at them. These gold cards are just absolutely amazing. Apparently, the uh, the top is um, textured as well. So it's not a smooth card. Apparently, they are textured. Don't quote me on it. It's just what I've been hearing. There it is, guys. The Arceus V-Star gold card. I believe this is going to be the big chase card from Crown Zenith. Um, it's it's just sublime. I mean, look at it. Look, look, at the, uh, look at the lighting at the background of the Arceus there. It just absolutely pops. And then it fades into darker colors on the way out. And it just, for me, that's going to be my big chase card. That is going to be the big chase card for myself and I think for a lot of people. I'm a big Arceus fan. Um, you know, my, a few of my favorite Pokemon are Charizard, Arceus, and uh, going back to Lapras. Um, they, but this is this is probably one of my favorite cards from this set, to be honest with you. And uh, this will be the biggest chase card for myself. Um, do we have any more? Is that Giratina? And that's Giratina. And then we're back at the Voltorb. Is that all of the cards from the set? I believe that might be all of the cards from the set. Now, oh, no. We have associated promo cards. Okay. So these are promo cards that you're going to be getting. I'm guessing these, these are going to be available in the collection boxes um, and maybe the ETBs. I don't know because obviously with Silver Tempest and Lost Origin, we didn't get promo cards in the ETBs um, like they did in previous sets. Um, so... Um, Unsure, these might just be available in collection boxes. But that looks like to be the Articuno. Then we've got the... Uh, is that Zapdos? That's Zapdos, I believe. Lucario. And the Moltres. That Moltres looks stunning. Look at that. Look at the Talons. Oh my god. That is insane. Very nice, very cool. But guys, yeah, this is the Crown Zenith list. Um, absolutely amazing pause. Thank you all so much for watching, uh, going through this uh, Crown Zenith list with us. Some amazing trainers, some amazing uh, artworks, and uh, yeah, just absolutely brilliant. Brilliant set. I cannot wait to open this. Uh, it comes out in January, guys, so stick around, and we will be getting some packs in for this. Uh, but guys, thank you so much for watching, and uh, don't forget to smash that like on the way out and subscribe to the channel, and uh, go back and watch a couple of the videos. There are some giveaways going on still, and uh, guys, thank you so much, and I shall see you on the next one.